Okay, we have another Toshiba laptop. Uh, this one's an NB505. It's a netbook with the admin password set. So what we're going to do is we're going to remove the password on this particular model as well. And we're going to do the same process we've been doing on the, on the other systems. So uh, here's uh, what it's coming up with. So what I'm going to do is now I'm going to close it and I will turn it off and then uh, start the process of uh, removing the items, remove the battery, remove the memory cover uh, and then we're actually going to do the jumper uh, on it so if, uh, if you have any questions please subscribe to our channel and post your comment and somebody will re reply to it again do not call us for support unless you're going to send your laptop in okay talk to you later okay so now what we're going to do is we're going to take out the battery uh, and just unlock it on this side release this latch uh, and you should be able to take out a battery i don't think if you're doing this you're competent and capable of doing it and then you have uh, three screws that have the cut uh, actually two screws you hold the cover and, and loosen this up and then pop it up right up and it comes right up now uh, what we're going to be working on is in this area here so remove the memory okay and okay now if you focus uh, the jumper that we'll be working with is right here it uh, looks like a U and a T on it so so we're going to we're going to jump for the U and the ground from the memory memory slot. So uh, so now what we're going to do is we're going to get the Cat Five and then jump for it for 30, 40 seconds. Okay, now cut a piece of Cat Five. Here's the one that we'll be using. It's the best conductor. So don't use a paper clip. I mean, you can use a paper clip but um, might not work for you so just take out one one cable you just need one so out of the cat 5 here you can see the what it is cat cat 5 e okay 24 gauge so that's all you need you don't need anything else as long as it's copper you're, you're pretty much set Okay, strip it. That same on the other side. It's a little hard on this. I don't have the, the stripper. So no wire strippers. So here's the jumper. Again, copper. Right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna reset the the BIOS chip on here. Now, if we have once you have the cable, now what you need to do is you need to jumper the U. You need to put one one on the U, and one end on the U, and the other end on on the memory memory uh, memory slot ground. So here and here. So uh, now you count to forty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty. And you release it and now what you do is you put the memory back to it okay <clears throat> you put the battery back on okay. turn it over and if you are successful you should get uh, CMOS you said, yep so we did it now it will tell you to 
System seamless check bad default configuration time and set. 